Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Arthur and welcome to an indie horror game called Submerged. But this is another indie horror game which is exactly like Narcosis called Submerged. And I think this was made for the Asylum Jam of 2017, I'll have to look that up. It'll be in the title if it is. But uh, let's go ahead and play. Uh, let's just leave it as it is. Controls. Movement, sprint, interact. Cool. Let's play. For educational use only. Oh, jeez. Not again. Okay, so we woke up. Fantastic. Oxygen mask? You must get out. Okay, that's actually kind of creepy. I like it. Why do we need no two tank though? We're not we're not underwater. We just woke up off of a bed. Save your breath. Oh. What? What? Oh. Uh here we here we go. Fuse, right? Okay, let's put the fuse in. Boop. Okay, we got the oxygen going back again. What's this? Date, 12-6-1965, so December 6th, 1965. I can't believe it. I just finished nuke school. The last 18 months have been a blur of white walls and fluorescent lights. I've never experienced anything like it. Out of 20 guys who started, only I f only 11 finished. Is that about Mike diving like that from a third story window? Guess the pressure hits everyone differently. Got a letter yesterday saying I had qualified for my first watch, feeling proud that I am no longer a, n a nub. Are they trying to say noob? H. Anderson. Is an oxygen tank. All right. All right. This game actually has some quality to it. I like it. But also Narcosis, Narcosis did too. And I hated that game. I absolutely hated it. I must get out. See, that's actually a cool effect. That's actually a pretty neat effect. Having like the uh... Wait. That was a repeat of the other room. The path is clear. Yeah, I just had to go around the... the smoke stuff. So I don't know if there's an actual monster in this game, or if it's just like, oh, you have to survive long enough... type thing, but it sounds like it's right behind me. That's super spooks. Don't think. Excuse me? Door controls. What did that do? Oh, I guess this must have been locked or something. I don't know. I'm just going the right paths. This room has repeated three times now. This is the third time I've seen this exact room. All right, let's run. Keep going. Ooh, okay. Okay. Okay, that's actually kind of cre creepy. Look, this is the same room! Let's close that. I don't want to listen to that. Eerie stuff. Mend that which is broken. Okay, I'm guessing this goes here. Hey, we did it! We mended the broken stuff. <laughs> oh no. Could you imagine, like, going through this? Your mind lies. Could you imagine having to go through this? Like, it's like... Okay, we got Fuse. Uh, you're just sort of casually walking around, and then you're just like, Oh, everything's breaking around me. Oh, uh, that's creepy. Is this supposed to be blood or water? I can't tell. Oh. Uh... Okay. Alright. Okay, we got another one of these. Got some oxygen. Perfect. It's like you're just doing your job, and then everything's just breaking around you, and then you see stuff like this, where there's just blood. 
for no reason. And then you're just like, what the heck happened while I was asleep? I took a freaking nap. Now everybody's dying. Oh, here we go. Let's put this in there. Twist the thing. Get a lever for something. I'm guessing it's for in here. Oh, here we go. Boop. Open this door. Heck yeah, my my guy. We're doing fantastic. Escape. Sure. Electricity, oxygen, door controls. Let's turn that on. And electricity. Let's turn that on. Let's see what we got here. See, this is kind of neat. I like this. But, again, at the same time, it's so much like Narcosis, it's not funny. Oxygen lever. Let's turn off electricity. Or can we just turn them all on? Let's just do that. Oh, we can only have two at the same time. Okay. Oh, okay, let's try... Uh, oxygen. And then oxygen exploder. Who who has a lever for that? Who explodes oxygen? Turn those off, turn on electricity and doors. Cool. We did it. We are progressing. Slowly but surely. I've seen this room so many times. Uh-oh, something got out. It is out. <laughs> That's what I just said. Something got out. Stimulating test subject. July 25th, 1965. Classified uh, test subject 72. Dr. A.G. Killy. Killy. After extensive testing, we have found out that test subject 72 is completely blind. It has an incredible sense of movement. Test subject shows high aggression when faced with high... Noises, notes, uh, almost ready for deployment. Interesting. So they're weaponizing these things? They're like people? They were messing with people and then like turning them into weapons? Liar. There's nothing ever behind you. Whenever. Okay. Whenever a horror game says something's behind you, there's never anything behind you. But those footsteps sounded like they were right frickin' behind me. And I hate it. I hate it. Hello? This room again! I mean, thank you for the oxygen tanks, but come on. Run! Run where? I've been submerged for a week now. I knew they would be keeping the oxygen under what we what are you uh what we are used to on the surface for fire prevention. I've read about the effects, but actually experiencing it is harder than I thought. I'm always tired and it seems that everything is going on my nerve. I'm not the only one though. Joey threw a cup a coffee cup at one of the navigators for walking too slowly. Hope that I get used to it sooner rather than later. H. Anderson. And this is on... What, March 7th, 1965? So, is there a monster or not? Like, yeah, you're giving me these noises and stuff, but that's not necessarily gonna spook me. Here's the room again. Because if there's not an actual monster, then why should I care? Oh, spooky noises. Sounds like it's right here. Oh, there is something! What the heck is that? Oh, no. Oh. Huh? Huh? Ah! Uh! It's an alien! It looks just like a freaking alien! That thing ain't human! Uh, uh, open! Uh, uh. 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 Am 
must get out. I'm trying. All right. Uh, open the door. Open. Run. Open. Run. Free us. What? Make your choice. Control room. Torpedo room. And generic room. Let's go with generic room. This looks nice. Ah. Uh, wasn't here. Control room. Release us. What do you mean release you? What? Periscope. Okay, it looks like a city. It looks like we're on a sub. Like a submarine. What is this? Torpedo room. Oh! No! You don't want me to blow this place up? I'm blowing this place up, most likely. Self-destruct. Uh... Yes, please. Okay, what's uh, generic room number one? What's through here? There is no escape. Okay, that's clever. That's clever. I like that. All right. Okay, either go this way to set them free or go this way to blow up the sub. Okay, I'm going to show you... I guess I'll show you guys both endings. I think that would be the most fair thing. But I'm going to blow them up first. Because I really don't want these monsters roaming free. If you know what I mean. Boop. No, you've told us. I don't care. Made the wrong choice. I don't care. Like what would happen if I set you free? That's the that's a good question. Probably a lot of mayhem. But he's blind, so he's not really that scary. I mean, he scared me. I was actually really creeped out. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Were we just like a toy the entire time or something? What was that? Educational use only. So that means they weren't using a licensed version. Okay, well, that game was kind of interesting. Again, uh, I kept comparing it to Narcosis for obvious reasons. If you guys haven't seen Narcosis, uh, pretty much, like, a lot of bad things keep happening underwater, and then, like, like, something about, like, the underground bases, like, got blown up or something, and then only a few survivors got out, and then it's just, like, Throughout the entire game, you were, like, underwater trying to find your way out by, like, some- One of your co-workers' voices is, like, luring you to get to the escape pod, and then you get there, like, at the last second. But it's all underwater. And then, uh, it's messing with your head, too, so things will pop up, corridors will change or disappear or, or rearrange themselves. It, it was all very much the same, just like this. This was a lot like Narcosis. And I hated Narcosis, alright? I absolutely hated the game. It was buggy, it felt sluggish, and the controls sucked. Uh, and because this is a Unity game, it felt the uh, sort of the same. It was very sluggish, sort of crappy, inspired of scary themes. Also, Google? What? Inspiration of scary themes. Yeah, they, it looks like they just googled a lot of things to put into the game. But again, I think this was made in just like that uh, 42 hour thing or 48 hour thing. My mom for birthing me. Saver's mom for birthing me. Ace's mom for birthing him. And so you get the idea. God for not... God for not existing, God for existing, my dad for teaching me I never- I need to cover all my bases, Mr. Ankry for not murdering me in my sleep, everyone that has ever met anyone in our lineage and not murdered them before having kids, food for keeping me alive, water for the same reason as food, my girlfriend if I had one, <laughs> the executives for not giving us a red light at midterms, the moon for keeping the tides going, 
Big Shaq for following his dreams. Ska for being such a nice word. Evolution for giving us a big brain, the only exception being Matthias. What? Video games for wasting my time. Adrian for paying me 10 bucks to be in the credits. The credits for being as long as the entire game. In loving memory of my cat that was run over when I was a child. Severs vape. My Toyota. <laughs> My lunch money, Ace's freedom, all the cows that now starve because of Katrine, Adrian's shame, Gummis's door, Michael Jackson, every king of Norway, Iceland, vanilla servers, Hollywood, Space's patience. What the heck? At least I have a sense of humor, I'll give it that. Hey, right, let's restart. Oh, you son of a gun. Oops, forgot to program that one. Here comes another one. It, it's a button, but it doesn't work. And they just... They they did it on purpose. Here comes another one. Oh my god. I like the credits. I never like typically like to read the credits, but I actually gave this one a try for once, and yeah. Okay, let's click it. Did you really think I would let you leave? There is no escape. The ride goes on. Interesting. There might be something more to this. Okay, so I noticed after this credit scene, the restart button's not there. The fake one isn't there. So there, there's got to be something more. So if somebody like me sat through all of this, we get something, hopefully. I would think so. Unless you want to waste my time. As you can see, I have removed the buttons. I don't like it when people quit on me. Well, I wasn't quitting, I was restarting. I was going to play more. I would never quit on you, Red Text. Not even the people making this game has any idea. Okay, this is kind of creeping me out a little bit. Red means scary, guys. Red means scary. I might just keep you here until I need you again. What does that mean? You don't need me. Mr. Ankry's final words. The ride never ends, the ride never ends, the ride never ends. Over and over and over. What is happening? Is this a part of the game or is this just like some little easter egg they put in for people who, like me, who took the time to get to the end of the credits and then to hit the restart button and then to watch the credits all over again. So this has been going on for so long that the music actually stopped looping. And like I still see little errors here and there like every once in a while so I think it's like it'll come to an end eventually but then it's just like now I'm not so sure, and now the only way for me to actually go back and go to the second ending is if I actually restart the game. And that's annoying. Because I just wanted to restart. I just wanted to hit restart, but then we get this. Thanks, devs. I really, really appreciate it. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay. Okay, so there was a little extra thing in there. That was interesting. Alright everybody, welcome back. We're gonna go with the bad ending, I'm guessing, is by letting them, letting them free. Because... Because last time we self-destructed the... the pod, and it just sort of like... made a toy jump, so I think we were like in a toy. I think this is like a meme game. This game's just a meme. And uh... Okay. Let's take a look at the city. Nice, beautiful afternoon. What do we do? Hit resurface? I guess we're setting them free. Let's do it. Well done. Nothing will remain after this. Whoa! 
What? 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 <laughs> what the heck was that? If you couldn't catch me, and I was just running, then how the heck, by coming out of the s out of the water, are you able to just level uh, a whole city in seconds? Like, I guess they used the torpedoes or something. I don't know. But jeez, they just... It was gone. <laughs> Alright, here, here we are. Back at the end of the credits again where the original little fake restart button is there. I'm not gonna push it. And I'm not gonna push the second one that comes up either. I wanna see what actually happens if I just let it run. There we go. If you miss this one, that's it. Oh, I bet there's more. Knowing you and your little games, your little mind games in the credits. I'll play your little game, your little credits game. Watch there just be like more and more restart buttons. It's just a list of restart buttons. If I miss this one, it's it. I don't care. Bet it's not. <laughs> well, now you just have to Alt F4, I guess. Now I can still press it if I want. Oh, now it's gone. Mr. Ankry's epilogue. I'm glad you decided to stay. What a journey it has been. And yet, it's not over yet, is it? Actually, it is. You're just watching this credits list that the developers decided to spend too much time on. I should mention that I am Mr. Ankri. You may have heard of me. You may have played with me before. We should do this more often. Oh, and we should discuss the buttons that you missed. They are not coming back. And I take a lot of pleasure in wasting your time like this. I'm not going to tell you when this ends, by the way. Yeah, you didn't tell me last time either, and I just sat there. And then finally when I alt-tabbed... A, like a top hat with a big A was on it. I'm playing your game. I'm playing it. I will sit here for hours if I have to. Not really. Because that'd be a waste of my time. I'm already wasting my time. I'm fairly sure some people ended up quitting after that last comment. I don't blame them. There really is nothing left after this. The game was over ages ago and here you are. Reading a pointless credits list that is mostly a lie. I'm collecting data on how many people actually read this. I hope you don't mind. I'll most likely sell it to a large corporate entity. I need to survive somehow, and this seems like an easy way to make money. Enjoy the rest of the credits list. Goodbye for now. There's more. There's more, you little liar. Sound designer's epilogue. Still here, I see. Now that I think everyone else is gone, should we change things up a little? I'm, I'm so tired of these guys making me do all the dramatic sounds. I wanted to make a Mortal Kombat spinoff. Alright, now I'm going to make a seamless transition and listen. And voila, much better. Can you see it? Bad guy come in and you just BAM! And he is just like, whoa! But then kablam! Skitterapoo! And then... And the dragon flies in and goes, Wah! Woo! Woo! Fire alarm goes off. Girls in bikinis in the distance. A volcano erupts. <gasps> Best game ever. Kaplash. The funny thing is, in the other credit sequence where it's just like the endless red text, this music played too, just about this time. Oh shoot, someone is coming. Time for another, another seamless transition. And I believe this is actually the last song. And then it just cuts. That's what happened last time. Alright everybody, there you guys have it. That was submerged. Both endings and both credit ending sequences as well. Which was kind of interesting. Cause, so I guess technically there's four endings. But two of them are hidden within the credits. So you have to waste your time. I've been recording for an hour. And I finished the game at like the 20 minute mark. 
So, I've been sitting in this credit sequence for quite a while, so there you guys have it. Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you want to go and play the game for yourselves, a link will be in the description. It was a pretty interesting short play. I mean, give it a shot if you'd like. It, it's not anything too special, but I mean, it's free, so if you want to get a little spook, you can go ahead and try it for yourselves, but anyway, as always, I'll see you guys later. Yeah.